Well, howdy diddly dandy there, chums. I've just logged in on my PlayStation D5, and look at this. Platform successfully collected. Your most recent save will now be uploaded and made available for download on any other connected platforms. This save will continue to be automatically uploaded during gameplay. The upload may take a few seconds. Oh, look at it. It looks dark. It's got a little cloud logo. OK, right. So now that this has got a little cloud logo there, that's my PlayStation save. That's my legacy cloud save. Let's go and load up my, up my PC, jump on over to my PC, and let's see if I can get my PlayStation save on my PC. <gasps> awesome! I didn't have to do much. I, I didn't do anything. Brilliant! Okay, right. Cool. Okay, right. So, inside of my mm, PC save. Ah! Uh -huh. Manage cross save. Okay. Oh, would you look at this, people. There it is right there. I can download it to local storage. Yes, please, download. No way! It's that simple. Okay, right, well, let's hit on up this. Okay, now, this is great. This is great because all the bases on PlayStation 5 at the moment are a little bit, how shall we say, squiffy. I can't actually visit my PlayStation 5 bases, well, like other people's bases on PlayStation 5. Now, I just found a really cool spot for fishing that's got droids all over it as well. And we're going to that planet right now. Now, someone has told me that they can't portal there because it seems that someone's built a base on the portal. Well, I couldn't see it on my PlayStation 5 because of the issues. So now that I'm on PC, I can see bases again, people. And look, yeah. That's the portal right there. Okay, well, someone's built a little fishing base right on the freaking portal. I mean... Why? Okay, let's have a quick look-see. Yeah, look, there's something directly above the portal as well. Your bases are extremely close to the portal. I mean... I put mine fairly close, to be fair. I mean, that's mine over there. But, yeah, they shouldn't really cause a massive problem if it's not encased on the portal. It might take people a little bit more time to load in on this planet. So you know what? What I'm going to do is I'm going to fly to all the other planets in this system, and I'm going to give you portal codes to the neighbouring planets. So basically, you can portal to those. Shouldn't have a problem. And then you can just fly over to this planet. Okay, so here we go. Let's fly on up to the atmosphere. Let's go to this planet first over here. It seems to be the closest one. This will probably be the best one to give you the portal code for. Gamma root emerald uranium. It's a radioactive planet. I'll let you know when I've landed. You won't believe this, chums. But this neighbouring planet's got droids on it as well. Two droid planets in the same verse. Look, droids. Huh! That's so cool! Anyway, I give you the actual coordinates for this planet. There you go, they're in the bottom corner. If I if I put the sun below the planet, there we go, that makes them a bit brighter for you. There you are, this is still in Euclid, and this is the neighbouring planet that also has droids on it. Now, if you do come to this planet, please don't build near the portal. <laughs> okay, cool. Alright, so hopefully people can get here unimpeded. It's the older platforms that are having the biggest of problems. PlayStation 4s, the Xbox X, Series, Box, whatever it is. And uh, the Switches that are having problems. So, you know, just be a little bit mindful that not every platform is able to render in. And even consoles such as you know, PC, or the well, one that's not a console, but, you know, even the next-gen consoles and PCs are having load, lo load times if you build on top of portals. right -o. Let's do, or, or in close proximity to a portal. Right, let's head on over to this mechanical planet. Now, this is an emerald and gold and silver planet. Now, this is one of these exotic worlds. Now, there is a good chance that this one... No, actually, you know, it's still going to have portals on it. Cool. OK, right, well, I've landed and I've disembarked from my shipty ship. Yeah. Right, okay, we need to give you the portal code for this planet. 
So you're going to notice a bit of a pattern. The portal code is pretty much the same, apart from the first two to three glyphs. And it's in those first three, well, two to three glyphs, where the portal, or the planet number in the system, you know, the sort of like, um, marked, basically. So, yeah, it's not a very differing code. But there you go. There you are. There's another portal code. So if you're having a problem with one, try another. Okay. What I would suggest is when you're portaling here, at your portal, put down like a manual save or something. And if you find that it's taking far too long to load in, just do a reload. Try another one of these portal codes and jump to the next planet, you know? Just in case people are people and they go and build portal bases on every single one of these. Which would be pretty annoying. Right, okay. Let's head on over here. It would completely lock down the system, wouldn't it, essentially? Right, we go to this vile brood planet now. There we go, and away I go. Okay, right, now there is one more planet inside of this system. However, people that have been playing for a long time will probably be able to work out what that portal code is. Right, so here we go. There's the final code that I'm going to give. Okay, so from that, you know what the missing glyph is for getting to the other planet. So just in case, I'm going to leave that one's portal code a secret, just in case every single one of these planets ends up with a base built on it. But there we go. That will get you to this awesome system. And uh, yeah, uh, the, the actual planet in question that is really cool for fishing is Planet New Bobby. New Bobby, freaking darn awesome. But you can see that there's quite a lot of bases already plastered all over New Bobby. There's like 39 other bases on Planet New Bobby alone. So there you go. Hopefully you can jump on over to all these other planets. Oh, look, someone's actually named that one Robits. <laughs> nice one. Salute on one, though. Freaking awesome. So there you go, people. That's the system in question. This is the planet where you want to be building your base and going fishing for nanites. If you missed the video on fishing for nanites and just getting nanites ambiently by feeding droid creatures, I'll put a link up there. You can go and watch that video. Heck yes, I'm super stoked with this cloud save malarkey, though. That is freaking great. Okay, right. Well, I want to say a massive great big thank you for everybody who's watched this video and everybody that's already come over to New Bobby. I can't believe that there's 40-odd bases appeared within like a 48-hour period. In fact, not even that. It's been 24 hours at most. Thank you very much, people. But yeah, just be mindful of um, the portal network and also those on platforms that may struggle to load in with anything that's complex in region of the said portal. I mean, yeah, I didn't build too far away myself. Naughty Steve! But at the same time, there's quite a few complex bases appearing now. Until next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.